and hey, welcome to the video guys i want to do a quick one today on utilizing the right style of breakers and manufacturers for your panel so i have a home line panel that we're working on today these existing breakers that somebody else put in here for a car charger etc this is a siemens type qt this is a siemens type qt and uh, i replaced this they do make a quad specifically for this panel that's where it's the tandemed uh, uh, mini circuit breakers now if you can see if i hope you can appreciate why you see how that qt doesn't plug all the way on to the bussing there's the gap is lot larger here and it's stick stuck out a little bit you can see that tip right there the same is true up here and the reason that is is if you look at the bussing there's a little tip that comes out and then there's the little ledge node stands off to the side well square d home line series has this little notch and i'm gonna this isn't eaten i'm right, trying to get you better better visuals see there's a notch right here for that little part of the bus bar the Eaton does not have it, and neither does the Siemens Type QT. So they do not have a little recess to allow it to push all the way onto the breaker or onto the bussing. See? So people say, oh, if it fits, it's good to go. That's not always the case. Now, are these operational and they're working? Absolutely, they're working um, just fine for right now, you know. But the bottom line is, is they do make the correct breaker. They also make, Eaton has, runs a series, the, the CL breakers, that are UL classified to fit in Siemens, GE, uh, et cetera, because they are all generally the same size as far as when they refer to a one inch spacing. Um, the only difference is the type QO square D is a three quarter, and that's typical to the CH Cutler hammer. But again, I'm getting off track here. So, just because it fits doesn't mean it actually fits all the way and correctly onto the bussing. And especially when you're running a 50 and a 30, you want to make sure that's seated on there all the way. So, thanks for uh, watching the video. If you like it, give it the thumbs up. Um, subscribe and uh, if you have any comments or anything please uh, put them in the uh, below there but these little things are important it gets passed by inspection I don't know why they are not um, catching that every time but you can get the right breaker sometimes it does take an extra trip or just being prepared or paying a little bit more money to stock with uh, UL classified breakers